Scott FM was launched in September 1994 and behind all the razzmatazz was a simple aim to target an audience of aspirational Scots between 24 and 44 by playing the music they loved and by providing them with the information they required. Galloway in the morning. Audience research showed there was a clear gap in the market between teen-orientated top 10 formats and the more sober sounds offered by the BBC. Scott FM has attracted some of the brightest talent in Scottish radio, like breakfast presenter Robin Galloway, who has a growing army of fans. In fact, Scott FM is Scotland's fastest-growing radio station, with Central Scotland's most upmarket audience. ABC One's make up 49% of its listeners. Hello? Hello? Oh, my God! Oh! <laughs> Lindsay Thomas, you are a winner! Congratulations! Oh, great. Well done. Oh, Are you happy? It's amazing. You're overcome with emotion now, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, that's cute. Well, I'm glad you're happy. Oh, thank you. Oh, thanks a lot, Rowan. All right then. Bye, Lindsay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. If you ask people where they listen to the radio most, they would probably say in the car. So not surprisingly, traffic information is a staple ingredient of the breakfast menu. Scott FM serves the heart of Scotland, nearly three million listeners in the affluent central belt. Galloway gets Edinburgh and Glasgow to work with a mixture of great music and cheeky chat. Good morning, it's nice to have your company at Scott FM with Bill Young with you. Bill Young moved back to Scotland after a successful stint in the north of England. His mid-morning and lunchtime show puts the accent on lifestyle reviews and interviews, music and fun. We're talking about boldness. Bold men did lose their self-esteem and therefore do they underachieve. I've grown hair back on hundreds and that, that is very significant. Right. Well, you haven't grown it back on hundreds. They've grown <laughs> okay. it back on themselves, sure. to be fair. I, okay. absolutely, you have guided absolutely them. Absolutely right. I've guided them, and I, I think that's very important. To you sound them. like Burt Lancaster and the Rainmaker there. <laughs> I've grown hair back on hundreds. Scott Health news till three and more news. After that, lunch, uh, Jerry Burke is the man behind the mic. There's music and tips on how to be healthy, wealthy and wise. Um, it's better to drink a little than drink nothing, and it's better to drink a little than a lot. The simple message is one drink a day, one drink of alcohol a day, one unit a day will lower your risk of heart disease. Let's emphasise the point again, it's better that than having none. Better than being okay. teetotal. Yeah. Yeah, tell that to Temperance Society. <laughs> Essential news and travel updates every 15 minutes. Serving 2.9 million people, there's clearly a lot happening. And seven days a week from before dawn to dusk, the news team are there to bring you the stories as they break. There are bulletins throughout the day with a special in-depth roundup of the day's news in the Scott Report between 6 and 7 p.m. every weekday evening. Across central Scotland on 100.3 and 101.1, this is Scott FM. The United Nations says its military commanders are urgently considering a strike against Bosnian Serb forces. Gordon withdrew from the Scots squad for the match against Greece, claiming he wasn't mentally attuned. Some of Scott FM's presenters have established celebrity status and are equally sought after for TV shows. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, love, but I do not think that any single woman should be working at all until we have full male employment. Scotty McClue, Scotland's own shock jock. He's controversial, cantankerous, sometimes compassionate, but always compulsive listening, enraging and engaging a huge audience. <laughs> when did you see me? When did you see me? Oh, I've seen you, I've seen you on that, the Scottish Men, oh, Scottish men. And I've seen you in the papers. In, in the, the papers? Yes. yes. My yes. name's never out the paper, you know. You're no, not at all. Totally no, absolutely not at all. Are absolutely you, not at all. I, I, wouldn't dis person? I wouldn't disregard people's feelings. Let's not have to dash. Scott FM scored a winner in the snatch of the day when the station secured exclusive rights for live Scottish League football commentary. Suggests Scottish football's in a healthy state Every Saturday afternoon from 1pm, Scott FM broadcasts live commentary and updates from every major Scottish League match. This was a major coup and Scott FM's investment is paying handsome dividends in listeners and advertising. Inside that box, where's it going to go? Across the face of the goal, it comes and the header and a goal! It's Pierre Van Hoydonk who gets the final touch to put the ball in the back of the Wraith Rovers net. We asked a moment ago, where are we going to get a goal to break the deadlock? Well, Pierre van Hoydonk has given us a very positive answer. And after the final whistle, fans block the switchboard, airing their views in a phone-in, indicating whether they're as sick as a parrot or over the moon. Great music for a great nation, Scott. The 
the station's music policy was devised by the listeners before the station was launched. Classic rock or adult contemporary was what listeners wanted, and that's what Scott FM has supplied seven days a week, 24 hours a day. And time on time again. It's not top 20, it's not middle of the road, but the songs which have gone the distance and lasted find their way onto Scott FM. Serving the central belt, Scott FM takes in well over half of Scotland's entire population. The capital and business centre are all there. From the Firth of Clyde to the Firth of Forth, Scott FM is the station at the heart of things. Our presenters like to get out and about from our studios in Leith to meet the people. A thunder truck is always an attraction when it rolls into town. On this occasion, a major furniture store near Stirling. Okay, here you go. Here's chili food. All right. Are you okay with that? Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to get somebody to come up and model a polo shirt and if they look really good in that polo shirt. Any of you guys fancy a Scott FM polo shirt? I swap you one. Hello, Brian. No, are you happy with the Warner Brothers stuff? Yeah. yeah so did you get it in, in Glasgow? Scott FM's unique mixture of music and speech offers advertisers the opportunity to buy into an environment sympathetic to their products. From motoring to movies, health to housing, Scott FM gives you some strong meat to get your teeth into and some sauce to savour. And there's a unique creative team ready to make your advertising dreams a reality. Scott FM. Music, speech and controversy. Scott Rock. Scott Talk. Scott Shock. Scott FM.